welcome to the Odd River Subdivision. I'm Ian, and in today's episode, we're going to be looking at how I did the stone wall um, along the bike path in the Lehigh Gorge. I decided to use a painter's caulk with stones. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what that looks like, and then I'm going to show you how I did it. So let's take a look at that. So I, before I went ahead and tried to put the um, wall on the layout, I took the small piece of foam, put some of the painter's caulk out, spread it, and then put the stones in. And I painted it just to get an idea if I thought this would look pretty good on the layout. And I really was happy with this little sample size here that I decided to go with this method instead of uh, carving plaster. So this is just to show you what it can look like once it's painted. And now we will get into how I did it. Okay, for the rock wall, it's been pretty simple. I've been using um, this painter's uh, latex caulking and these stone granules to make the wall. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to show you how I did it on this section here. Okay guys, that's going to wrap up my little how-to here on my stone wall. Um, I will be painting it. I don't think, maybe I'll do a video on that. Maybe it'll just be in a layout update. Um, I have to figure out a way to make a concrete cap for the top of my stone wall and where it meets the uh, rock formation right there by the bridge abutment. And there's a couple holes you can see that I got to touch up where the stones didn't fill in. But for the most part, the wall is pretty much done. And I think once it's all painted and everything's in here, it's really going to have a nice look to it. So thank you for watching. I hope you found this informative. And um, maybe it'll give you some ideas for your layout. <laughs> 